Hi, this is Hillary from Blue, and let's check out Snowball Ice. Snowball Ice is a plug and play USB microphone for recording everything from instruments to vocals to podcasts, live streaming, or even dictation. As a plug and play USB microphone, Snowball Ice connects directly to the USB port on your laptop or desktop computer, and without having to download any other drivers or software, will work with your favorite recording program. Snowball Ice features a condenser mic capsule. A condenser capsule delivers the rich, detailed audio you typically find in studio recordings. Snowball Ice has also been tested by engineers and awarded Skype certification for the ultimate clarity on your Skype calls. Snowball Ice also records directly in front or in cardioid for single source or single person recordings. Snowball Ice comes with an adjustable desktop stand, but also has a standard thread on the bottom for mounting to a traditional mic stand. For more information on Snowball Ice, visit bluemic.com. Hey guys, I just wanted to share with you our new special blend here this week at Cleveland's. It's made by our friends down at Little Marionette and it's called the Sanchez Number no. 7. It's Rosemary here. I finally made it to the Cherry Blossom Festival that I told you about. And if you look behind me, it is absolutely incredible. The season only lasts for one more week, so make sure that you get down here. And if you post pictures, tag me so that I can see. The driver says skip and the wingman wants to listen to the song. There's three times that he can say, no, I'm not skipping this song. I think that's really reasonable. They're great rules. It's warm and sunny. It's not. It's actually quite windy. Yeah, it's a little bit chilly. But, but we wish you were here. Exactly, we do. And we'll see you soon. Very soon. Bye. Bye. Hi, this is Hillary from Blue, and let's check out Yeti. Yeti is a multi-pattern USB microphone. As a plug-and-play USB microphone, it connects directly to the USB port on your laptop or desktop computer, and without having to download any other software, will work with your favorite recording program, whether you're recording to GarageBand or Audacity, podcasting, dictation, or even Skype. Yeti features three condenser capsules. A condenser capsule delivers that rich, detailed audio you typically find in studio recordings. As a multi-pattern microphone, Yeti offers four polar pattern options, or directions in which the mic will pick up sound. Yeti will record in cardioid, which is directionally to the front, great for instruments or single person podcasts. Yeti will also record in omnidirectional, which is 360 degrees around the mic. This is great for band practice, a chorus, or multi-person podcasts. Yeti will also record in stereo, which is right and left. This is great for instrument recording to get your right and left separation, or for voice and vocals, it gives you an open, natural room sound. And last, Yeti will record in figure of eight or bi-directional, which just means front and back. This is great for duets or interviews. Yeti features some studio controls directly on the mic. On the back above your polar pattern selection, you have analog gain control, which allows you to adjust the sensitivity of the microphone. You can also plug headphones directly into Yeti for zero latency direct monitoring, which is great for multi-tracking or just being able to hear exactly what you're recording without any echo or delay. 
Yeti features headphone volume on the front, as well as a mute button in case you have to sneeze in the middle of a podcast. Yeti comes with this desktop stand, but also has a standard thread for connecting to a traditional mic stand, or the Radius, which is Yeti's custom shock mount sold separately. Hey everybody, it's Phil with Behringer. How are you doing today? Welcome to Music Group Studios. I want to talk to you today about the Euphoria UM2. This is an audiophile 2x2 audio interface with a Xenix mic preamplifier. So in the studio, this is going to be great for either if you're producing your own tracks and you're in the control room and you just need a two input thing, awesome, it's going to work out great. If you have somebody in the booth in a separate room, you know, and you want to record with them, you know, where it's this producer and singer on the opposite side of the glass, it's going to work for that as well. You can either have the box in the control booth with you or out in the booth for the vocalist or whatever else you're hooking up to the UM2. So this is a 2x2 audio interface, USB out and analog out, and there's ways to plug into it, such as the combo jack and the quarter inch jack on the front. So one input, like I said, combo jack, which means XLR or quarter inch can be plugged in, and then the second input is a quarter inch. Also on the front panel is a headphone jack, a stereo headphone jack for monitoring, and a switch for direct monitoring, because this is a USB computer device, right? So this takes time for the signal to get from the microphone to the box, through USB, to your software, and back, okay? It's called latency, and it can be a problem when you're recording. Not if you hit the direct monitoring switch on the front of the UM2. It gives you the signal right off of the microphone so you hear it directly, okay? So when you're recording with the software, there's no delay whatsoever. It's awesome. So on the back panel of the UM2, you have the two analog outputs on RCA. You do have phantom power in this to power that Xenix mic pre. And what that means is that you can use dynamic or condenser microphones, studio grade condenser microphones. So it gives you a wide array, a lot of choices of what kind of microphone you want to use, which means you can record a lot of different kind of signals as well. Anything from guitar amps to vocals, whatever you want. The UM2 is powered via USB, so you don't have to worry about any other wall warts or anything else to connect with on this. You just plug the USB port into the back of this, it's powered, and then you can plug your audio source in and record right away. So traction software is available at Behringer.com as a free download. So you get the UM2, you get the software, you start plugging and playing and recording right away. How cool is that? The UM2 is going to work cross-platform, and by that I mean it's going to work on XP or on Mac OS. You're not going to need any drivers or anything like that. It's so simple. It's plug and play. You connect it in, it's going to work. And the UM2 is going to be seen and be usable with all the popular you know, software platforms. So it's going to work on Logic, Pro Tools, Cubase, uh, all the usual suspects are going to see it and work right away. So the UM2 is going to be great live in the sense that if you're a touring musician, you know how it is on the road, you're touring, you still want to record, you have great ideas, but you're not in your studio and you can't get access to a studio after a gig, maybe 11 or 12, 1 o'clock in the morning. However, when you get back to the hotel, you have your laptop and the UM2 and you can continue to write music. You have status, signal, and clip lights so that you can overview and see all your signal levels at a glance. So this is the UM2. For more information and media, please feel free to come visit us at Behringer.com. Thanks for joining us here at Music Group Studios. This beautiful wooden music center by Victrola conveniently has eight features in one. Whether you're listening to a vinyl record, tuning in to your favorite radio station, enjoying a classic cassette or new CD, this wooden music center can play it all. If you have a favorite playlist on your device, connect through the aux in port, or simply connect via Bluetooth for a wireless listening experience. In addition, this wooden music center gives you the ability to take your old vinyl records and cassettes and convert them directly to MP3, with no computer required. To record, simply insert a USB, press record, start playing your favorite music, and it will effortlessly transfer to MP3. Also included is a full function remote control, three replacement turntable needles, an LP cleaning cloth, and an 8GB USB drive. With this beautiful, warm wooden cabinet housing powerful built-in stereo speakers, we are sure you'll enjoy your favorite music for years to come.
Jams is an app-enabled guitar pick from Zivix. Now if you can play air guitar, you can make real music with air jams. Simple motions trigger notes, power chords at the touch of a button. The Jamstick Plus is the easiest way to learn how to play the guitar, period. The Jamstick is the complete guitar lesson system with apps for the iPad, iPhone, and Mac to help users learn how to play. The Jamstick is the only product that can see and show your fingers on screen to guide right from wrong. Let's strum all six strings just like this. Okay, now you try. All right. Partnering with the developers Musopia, users can learn thousands of songs with the Jamstick Plus edition of the Four Chords app. The Jamstick Plus never needs tuning. It uses your iPad, iPhone, or Mac to generate sound, and it already works with more apps than we can keep track of. You can learn and practice on your terms with the Jamstick Plus. We've seen users start playing chords in minutes with the Jamstick, and its portability can turn just about any environment into a practice or lesson studio. And thanks to advancements with Bluetooth 4.0 technology, we equip the Jamstick Plus with wireless Bluetooth connectivity that works seamlessly with Apple's new Bluetooth MIDI software. The Jamstick Plus has the same real guitar strings and real frets just like the original to best match the experience of putting your fingers on a guitar. The Jamstick Plus works with your iPhone or iPad to get great musical performance out of apps like GarageBand, Loopy, and hundreds of others. The Jamstick Plus is also a great MIDI controller for your Mac. In Yosemite, you can play any sound available in Logic, Ableton Live, Pro Tools, and other DAWs.